do this. I'm Courtney, this is Hit and Strength. Today we are just using weights. You're gonna definitely want a couple sets of weights because we have some basic exercises, certain exercises you're gonna want to go heavy. If you don't go heavy, you're gonna think, why am I doing this boring class, right? So you wanna challenge yourself, keep your body fit and challenged, keep your brain challenged, and to do that, we wanna go heavy. So grab a few sets of weights, let's warm up. Jabs, crossing. This is not a kickbox workout. This is the only kickbox move we are doing today. So enjoy punching it out. Put some power in those punches. We are gonna have fun today though, I promise. The last cardio, the last Tabata that we're doing is a little tricky. That is why we're working not only our body, but also our brain. 10 seconds. Going into two calf pushes to two twists in five. Three, two. Here we go, push it back for two. Twist it out for two. Make it big. Big arms. Feeling your calf stretch out slightly as you push back. Make sure your toe is facing the front. Good. I feel your energy. We're moving, we're grooving. We have 15 more seconds going into leg swings. Four right, four left, bent leg swings. You can always hold a chair or a wall. For balance, three, two, let's go, swing it. Switch legs. Just opening up those hips, those hip flexors. Nice. So as always, we have five exercises of strength followed by alternating cardio for a full Tabata, four rounds of two exercises, 12 seconds. Three rounds of that, followed by our finishers, cardio and abs. Three, two, bent over, swim swings to two squats. Swing it out for two, squat it for two. Push that booty back, sit it down, Opening up your chest on those swim swings. Hey, guess what? The Olympics are coming soon. <laughs> you guys like to watch swimming? I love it. 20 seconds. Such amazing athletes. I love watching them. They are training very hard right now. They have been training hard their whole lives, right? Eight seconds. Just like us, right? Just like us. Four, three, heading to the floor, inchworm out to plank, then push back to downward dog, inchworm your hands back in. You are an athlete, you might not be an Olympic athlete, maybe you are, I don't know, but you are an athlete. You're super strong, tough, strong-minded, 20 seconds, you're here, ready to rock this workout, ready to get strong. Eight seconds, coming up, we have lunged hamstring, two, one. Bring one foot forward for a lunge. Push up to a hamstring stretch, back down, switch out those legs. Good work. Getting loose, getting limber. That way when we fire, when we really start to fire up those muscles, you're not gonna get hurt. 17 more seconds. Going into side planks. We'll alternate sides. Five. Three, two, 
next one side, side plank, bring that other hand up and over, stretching toward the front. This is a great chance to test yourself. See if you can balance on one side. See if you can stack those feet one on top of another. If not, you can always keep them staggered. You can always put a knee down as well. Let's get that stretch in. 20 seconds to try. Then we stand it up. Good, keep switching sides. 10 seconds. Coming up, jog in place. Two, one, stand it up, jog it. Let's bring some bounce into our legs. At any time, you can always take the jump out of anything and go low impact. Maybe you're dealing with an injury. Maybe you're just trying to protect your joints. Whatever it is. Always ways to modify. Heading into a forward lunge with a release. We'll alternate sides in eight. Four. Two. Let's go, big step forward. Bring that leg up, step it in, other side. Pushing off that front leg, putting some effort into your quads. Big bend and then bring it up, push it off. Heart rate starting to come up now for sure, right? Looking good. 15 seconds to go. One more exercise of our warm up coming up. Side to side runs. In six. Two. Side to side. Side to side. Getting those stabilizers ready. Those ankles. Come on now, let's really move. Feeling my abductors too. Lately, I've been working double time on my glutes, trying to prepare, prepare for this marathon, getting my glutes as strong as possible to go the 26 miles, and I really feel them working now. They are sore, 10 seconds. Four, two, Woo, rest. Wow. That was quite a warm up. I'm already so out of breath. How about you? Out of breath, feeling strong, feeling energetic, feeling much better than when we started. Grab water. Doing a lot of unilateral work today. 20 seconds, so you can definitely go heavier, maybe not on this first exercise, maybe medium to heavy. We have both arms and legs up. We go in 10 seconds. Right arm and left leg dropping, coming back to center. Three, two, let's go, we're on. Try to keep that lower back on the floor. Option to always bring that right leg to the floor if you'd like. You can bring that leg to the floor a little more challenging to keep both feet up. Working our abs, working our lats, hip flexors. So like I said, we're doing a lot of movements today with just one side at a time. And that really allows us to really focus on our weaker side. Try to pump it up a little bit to match the other side. Do you have a weaker side? Maybe, maybe not. Either way, working one side at a time will help. Three, two, rest it. I think we're still on the floor here, let me check. Yes, stay on the floor, single chest fly. We're using both weights this round, but we are dropping one at a time with a bridge, so lift those hips up. 
Chest fly, one arm at a time. Here we go. Hips nice and high. So next round, we will work just one side only. So assess yourself right now. Do you need a heavier weight? You can always double up on weights too, if you feel comfortable holding two weights in one hand. Feeling the difference of one hand at a time versus both. Really working that core a little more to bring that weight back to center. 20 seconds. Come on, lift those hips a bit. You got it. We got seven. Two. One. Hips come down, legs come up, roll yourself on up to standing. One weight needed, put the other weight down. Into your right hand, into a right lunge. We're gonna try to hold it down with the right lunge the whole time. Digging your elbow into your thigh, bicep curl. Here we go. Try to hold this lunge for the whole time. A lot of pressure on your leg. Also, of course, your bicep. You can always put that knee down if you need to. I'd rather you try to stay up though. All right, team, we are about halfway. Keep going, keep curling. Stay down. You got this. Twenty seconds. We got a fun one coming up after this. 10, come on. Almost there, a couple more. Four, three, two, rest. Heavy weights, if you got them, heavy, heavy weights. We have one row to a knee lift. Narrow row, so flat back over, one row, then to a squat, lift that knee. Fun. Here we go. It's all about fun around here. Good. We will hold the rows for the last 20 seconds. Working on our balance with the knee lift. 10 seconds to go till we hold those rows. Hold the rows, hold the rows. Elbows come up and pinch slightly together toward the center. Way to work that back. Five. Three. Two. Rest. All right, switch to medium weights, medium weights. Coming back with the right leg into a lunge with a shoulder raise, pushing off, bending that knee and coming back to center. It's a lot, it's a lot. You ready? Let's go. We got some of that brain work here. Big step back. Lots of balancing today too, huh? This is the final exercise of our strength set. Going into cardio after this. Oh yeah, I feel that booty. It's working. Stay with this combo, about 20 seconds. Good job. Seven. Two, one, rest. Set your weights down. Woo, I felt that one. All right, first exercise of two. Side shuffle to two knee twists. Side shuffle to two knee twists. 
followed by a burpee. You can walk or jump the burpee into a lunge. And then we switch sides on the other one. Seven seconds. Are you ready for action? Three, two, side shuffle. Let's go. Two punch downs. Come on. Use the floor you've got. Use that space. Five seconds. Three. Rest. Burpee into a lunge. If you can walk the burpee out, you can also walk the lunge forward. Three, two. Let's go, let's go. Come on, push. Eight seconds. Two. Rest. I can tell I'm gonna be a sweaty mess soon. Three, two, shuffle, punch it. Good. Way to move. Eight. Three, two, rest. Let's see here. This little mic is getting in my way. All right. Burpee, two, one, let's go. Come on. Big bend in your knee on that lunge. Drop way down. Challenge your legs. Six. Two, one, boom. Whew. Great work. Powering up right now. Two, one, side shuffle. Knees. Come on. We are getting fitter, faster, stronger together. Six seconds. Two, rest. Burpee, yay. Three, two, let's do it. Try different things. You can try a little hop in between. You can try going straight into it. Six seconds. Two, rest. Oh man. Last set. Shuffle, two, one, go. You look so good. I love it. 10. Four. Two. Rest. Oh. 20 more seconds. And then drinks for everyone. Two, one, go. All right, let's pick up that speed a little. You got this. Eight seconds. Three. Rest. Uh, walk it out, rub it out. Grab some water. You're on fire. How's your heart rate? Mine is high. <laughs> I don't trust this thing though. I don't know how accurate it is. If you had a heart rate monitor, I think that'd be different. All right, now's a good time to hit that thumbs up on the workout. 15 seconds till we go. We have that other side. Left leg comes down, right arm comes down. Same as before, seven seconds. Legs up, arms up. Three, two, let's do it. 
Left arm, right leg. Opposites. Try to get those legs straight up over your hips. Starting round two, how do we feel? We warmed up now. Steve says, oh yeah. Remember, I do have these classes live twice a week. You can join us live, sweat with us, chat with us, 10 seconds. Link is in the description. Four. Two. Rest it. All right, staying on the ground. We have right arm only chest fly. I think I'm gonna keep my other weight for both weights. And we'll just keep it up. Go heavy if you can. Two, one. It is a chest fly, so maybe not your heaviest, but heavier than medium. Try to relax your face. Hips are up. We are here, so settle in. We're not changing a thing. We're just gonna be here till the bitter end. Let's go. Try to extend that right arm out a little more. 20 seconds, unless your weight is super heavy. Maybe you can drop that weight toward the floor. One inch further. Yes. Eight seconds. Couple more. Three, two, rest. Hips come up, legs come up. Roll yourself on up to standing. Get rid of one weight. We got that bicep. Ready for the other side? I know you are. Come down into that lunge with me. Two, one. Let's go, curl it up. I do love how this exercise works on my flexibility as well. Especially for me, this side is a lot less flexible than the other side. So staying down like this with the load really works on opening up my hips. You feel it too? Or are you just super flexible? Some of you out there are just so flexible. So lucky. Well, is it luck or is it work? I don't know. Maybe a little of both. 20 seconds. All of us are born with strengths and weaknesses, right? We do our best. 10 seconds to go. We're shaking now. Three, two, ah, rest. Woo -hoo! Coming out of that movement is a little Awkward, yes? <laughs> That's okay. All right, reverse fly to knee lift. Reverse fly this time instead of the row. Two, one, let's go. Just like before, we will hold the reverse flies this time for the last 20 seconds. Sweating yet? Good. 15. Let's see if I have any stories. Four, three, two, let's go reverse flies only. Something to distract us, huh? Something besides running, Courtney. That's the only subject I have lately. 10 seconds. Five. Three. Two. Rest. Woo. Medium weights, medium weights. Other side, left leg back to the lunge. Coming in, bend the knee. You know it, right? I don't need to demonstrate it. Three. Two. The complicated one, let's go. 
I have been having so many amazing conversations with all of you that are booking calls. I love hearing all about your lives and helping out with fitness plans, motivation, just getting chatty. Thirty seconds to go. Can you bend your knee a little more before you bring your feet together? Yes, you're rocking it. Who's ready for the next Tabata? Eight seconds. Two. Rest it. Ah. Set those weights down. All right, first exercise is a skater with a hop. Skater with a hop. Followed by, ooh, on the floor, climbers for four to a catcher squat. Here we go, 10 seconds. Make sure on that squat, you lift your head up just like you're gonna catch the ball and drop your hips down. Three, two, skate it. Let's go, skate it, hop it. Or lift it if you're not hopping. Come on, hop out there. Further than you could step. Six. Three. Two. Rest. Bring it down. Whew. Here we go, climb it. Two, one. Climb for four, three, two, one. Squat it. Hop. Catch that ball. Come on, power up. So Kirby. Five. Two. Rest. Oh. Round one done. Just three more. Two. One. Skate it. Go, go. Reach. Reach side, reach up. Eight. Looking good. Three. Rest. Oh. Wow. So explosive. Three. Two. Climbers, go. You ready to catch that ball? You looking for it? Nine. Push it, Steve. Three. Two. Rest. Bring it up, bring it up. You're halfway. Three. Two. Skate it. Let's go. Go, go. Power off that leg. Ten seconds. Five, three, rest. Oh. Oh, talk about unilateral movement. Whew. That's a toughie. Three, two, go, go. Come on. Looking good, Donna. Ten. Three, two, rest. Oh, all right, superstars. One more set. Three, two, skate it, go. Yes, fired up now that we know it's our last time. Eight seconds. Three, two, rest. Way to take it all the way to the end. Amazing. Three, two, climb it. Oh. 
Yes, we're breathing hard. Yes, we're uncomfortable. This is your chance to push it even further for five, three, two, one, zero. You did it. Round two, checked off. Killing it. Grab water, walk it around. Catch your breath a little bit. Oh. oh my goodness. How are we feeling today? Towel off, get ready. 18 seconds, round three, coming up. This time, both arms, both legs. What do we think of that? You can always keep your feet on the floor if you'd like. Dropping both down, coming up, crunching. Three, two, here we go. So like I said, if you wanna just do your arms, you can keep your feet on the floor as you drop down, then you can bring them up for the little crunch if you'd like. Try to keep that lower back on the floor. I say that because mine is lifting. Sometimes when we're fatigued, we lose our form just a bit. <clears throat> Let's try to bring it back in. 25 seconds. <clears throat> wow, I feel those abs working. <clears throat> 10. Go. Come on, maybe one more. Four, three, two. Rest. Whew, roll it on up. We have oh, left, left arm, chest fly, chest fly, left arm only with the bridge. Two, one. Let's go, drop it down. Relax your face, smile. Try not to clench your jaw. I know it's hard. <sighs> wow, I felt my abs so much on that last one, did you? And I say that because feeling the abs work again, trying to stabilize in the center. <sighs> Fabulous, you are looking so fit, so strong. We are in round three. Getting close to our finishers, kind of. 14 seconds. Let's go. Raise those hips, squeeze that booty. Five, three, two, rest. Hips come down, legs come up. Roll yourself on up to standing. Okay, we got both. We got both, this is a hard one though. Bicep curls in a squat. I want you to try to hold that squat the whole time, digging your elbows into the top of your thighs. Two, one, let's go. Stay down with me. I don't wanna see you popping up. Great work. Straighten your arms all the way at the bottom before coming back up. If it's too much to come this low, you can always hold just a regular squat, right? You don't have to come all the way down. 22 seconds. Oh boy, the sweat is just pouring now. It's warm today. We're heating up on the weather. Eight seconds. Shaking, shaking. Three, two, rest, come on up. Heavy weights, heavy weights. Wide row to, to knee lift, wide row. So palms are facing the back, bringing it wide. Three, two, let's do it. All right, form check here. We're two separate positions. Our chest is down, 
And then we come on up, making sure that your shoulders are back and down. We don't want them rounding. No rounding. We gotta keep that posture going. That perfect posture that you had. 15 seconds till we hold those rows. Six. That's right, you are a dynamite. Just like the song says, hold those rows. Coming wide, but bringing your elbows slightly together at the top, pinching your back. 10. Come on, come on. Three, two, rest. Whew. All right, medium weights, alternating sides. We have that shoulder raise, the lunge, the knee bend. We switch legs. You with me? Three, two, let's go. Of course you're with me. You wouldn't even think of not being, right? We're going all the way, baby. Through the finishers, through the stretch, to the end. Big bend. You're working it. Love all the balancing today. Don't you? Just think. With all this balance work, you're never gonna have one of those big falls that's gonna put you out. Six. Three. Of course, I can't promise that. <laughs> I wish I could set the weights down. Okay, oh boy, oh this is right. We got the crazy cardio. All right, one side only. Right leg comes up, we switch. Then come back down. Right leg up, switch. Then, second exercise is a twist to a ranger, staying on one side. Twist, ranger. All right, we ready? What's first, what's first, I forgot. Two, one, walk up switch. <laughs> walk up switch. You can always walk up, walk down. You don't have to do the switch. Eight seconds. Your variation works perfectly as long as you're moving. Three, two, rest. How forgetful am I, right? All right, twist to ranger. One side only, one side only. Pick a side, here we go. Like I said, we're working brain and body here, as well as memory. Seven. Oof. Come on, drop that hip. Two, one, rest. Oh. Ready to try the other side? Okay, three, two, left leg up. Let's go, switch. Stay low as you switch. You're not coming all the way up and switching. That's way too easy. Stay low. Eight. Four. Two. Rest. Anybody banging your knee? Try to come down softly. Here we go. Three, two, other side. Twist it. Go. Ranger. Lots of abs. Come on. Boom. Four. Two. Rest. All right. One more time each side, team. Try not to bang that knee. It's all about control. Use those legs you got. Two, one. Let's go. This is where the muscle comes in. Lowering that knee softly. Eight. Whew. Yeah, I feel those legs. Three, two, rest. Oh. Draw me to the 
four. Here we go, three, two. Let's go, twist. Go, push out. Drop that hip as you come through with the twist. 10. Five. Two. Yeah, rest. Oh. All right. Left side, and then we're done. Oh my goodness. Two. One. Step it up. Switch it. Hip the low, low, low. You only want your head to rise up by a few inches. 10 seconds. Good, Alma. Four. Two. Rest. Oh. Those legs, those legs. All right, last 20 seconds. Two. One, twist it. Shoot it out. Keep going. Just keep moving. That's all I want you to do. Seven seconds. All the way. Two. One. Rest. Oh. How do we do? Did you do it? Did you get it by the end? You did amazing. Crushed it. Workout is getting close to the end. We still have our finishers. Lots of stars coming up because why? You're a star, that's why. Okay, first star. We have high knees to star jump. High knees for four, one star jump. In 10 seconds we go, we are one minute on. One minute of continuous movement. Are you ready? Final cardio. Two, one, let's go. Come on, get those knees up. Good, Zach. We're here together. Feeling strong. Ready to finish out the cardio. You are close to halfway. This is half. Come on, bring out the beast right here. Bring out the animal in you. You're so fierce. 15. This is where you bring on the energy, right here. Pump up those knees. Eight. Three, two, rest. Oh, you did it. Sometimes I get chills. Woo. When we work so hard, yeah? All right, 30 seconds. Take a sip if you need it. Coming down onto our right elbow. When you're ready, left knee is popped. We have a toe foot touch to a knee lift. Adductor, toe is facing forward. We go in six. Come on down. Three, two, touch that foot. Crunch it up. You can keep your hips on the floor or you can lift them as you crunch in. As long as your shoulder's happy about it. Just make sure you keep that foot facing forward. That's the hardest part, to keep it forward. Pretty soon, if not already, I know I already feel my inner thigh screaming going, what are you doing to me? We're making you stronger there. 10 seconds. Five, three, two, oh, rest. Wow. Did you feel that? I know I did. All right, here's our other star. 
last star of the day. Except for the end when we officially name you a star. Crunch to star. Here we go, we're on. Crunch, extend out, star. Give it a try. You can always bring your feet to the floor and then extend your arms out to a star if you want. Try to keep that lower back on the floor. That's right, we have a little less abs in our finishers working those inner thighs today, which is nice for a change because we already worked abs a lot during the workout with the twists, with the uh, leg drops with the lat pull down. Five, three, two, rest. Who else is done with stars? Oh, all right, on to your other side. You're like, I'm so done with stars, I don't even wanna be a star anymore. <laughs> Are we ready? Left leg, two, one. Make sure that foot is facing forward, team. This is our second to last exercise. Yes, it is. Before we stretch. Turn that foot out as much as you can. The more you turn it out, the more you're gonna feel that inner thigh. You're like, then why would I wanna turn it out? <laughs> because strong inner thighs equal Less groin, less groin pulls, less injuries. That's what we want. 10 seconds. Five, three, two, rest. Woo. Last exercise. One of a fan favorite, heel touches. Heel touches, you can actually touch your heels or you can keep your hands behind your head and go side to side. Two, one, let's go. Or you can switch. If, you, if your neck is just can't take it, that's why you put your hands behind your head. But if you can stand it, it's actually kind of satisfying to feel yourself touch your foot each time. You're like, yes, I'm doing it. I'm touching. <laughs> Only 20 more seconds of this hard workout left. <sighs> Who's ready to be a star? <laughs> All of us, right? Eight. <sighs> Three, two, one. Reach it back. Open up. You are officially a star. A star dead on the floor <laughs> from all that hard work, right? You did it. Go ahead and bring your knees into your chest. Roll out those ankles. <sighs> nice. And let's just go ahead and roll up a few times, up and down. How good does it feel right now to be done with the hard stuff? Doesn't it feel amazing? Now you're ready to take on the day. Last roll up, come on into center splits. Bringing your legs wide, reaching out to the front if you can. And then walking over to one side. And walking over to the other side. Coming back center. Bringing it up, bringing that right leg forward, left leg to the back. Just bringing your chest down toward that leg if you can. Feeling your hamstring stretch out. Got a bit of a funky hamstring on this side lately. So glad you're staying with me for the stretch. an important way to just calm ourselves down, stretch out our bodies, relax, think about all the hard work we did 
Just go ahead and bring that back leg over to the front, coming across, twisting out, twisting toward your front leg, whichever leg is in front, twisting toward that side, feeling your hip stretch out. As always, all links are in the description, what I'm wearing, my mat, Amazon, one-on-one -on -one coaching calls, live class, the whole shebang. Let's go to the other side and get that hamstring. So happy you joined me today for this workout. You did it, you came, you conquered. You are amazing. Takes a lot of grit to get through this one. Go ahead and bring that back leg to the front. Swing it on over and twisting for that front leg. Lifting up through your chest, taking one big deep breath in. And as you exhale, try to twist a little more. Any vacation plans coming up? Tell me about it. Tell me about it in the comments. I love hearing about vacation. Makes me jealous, but I love living vicariously through you. Just go ahead and extend your legs, both of them forward. Reach for your toes. Do you like to work out on vacation? Or do you just take a strict vacation and you're like, this is, I'm gonna relax, I'm gonna enjoy or maybe working out is a big part of your relaxation, so you do that too? Let me know. All right, coming into kneeling position. This might be enough for you right here to feel your quads or just a slight lean back, or if you're extra flexible, you can bring your feet out a little more and come all the way back, all the way back if you'd like. Be careful, be careful. This is our final stretch. We don't want to get hurt now after all of that, right? And gently bring yourself out of that stretch. Bring yourself through forward fold. Slowly roll it up, head comes up very last. Wow, we made it team. How do you feel? You should feel like a champ. I know you're a star. I know you are. We did so well today. You worked it so hard. You absolutely destroyed those exercises. Tell me which one was the hardest. All right, have a great one. Grab water. Have a wonderful day. I'll see you for the next workout. next torture session is coming soon. <laughs>